Hello and welcome to Calvin Ball, the craziest, most unpredictable and exciting online scrapbooking challenge. I'm your host, Alice Ball, and we are ready for a month of crazy and exciting scrapbooking with a lot of unpredictable surprises tossed in. If you're not registered for Calvin Ball, it is not too late. You can join anytime through the month of March. Go to scraphappy.org slash Calvin Ball. Okay, here's what you need to know to get started. Throughout the month of Calvin Ball, every day you will have two kinds of rules added. And those rules are basically your way of collecting points throughout the month. There are permanent rules. Permanent rules are things that are added to the list and they are going to stay there through the whole month. And then we have rules that are temporary rules. And that's right, temporary rules are only there for a short amount of time and you gotta use them while they're available, otherwise they're gone. Now, what kinds of things can be a rule? For example, there can be a rule that says you get a point for using a star. That doesn't mean you get two points for using two stars one point per item on the list. So one star, one point. Maybe there's green on the list. So then you could get a point for using green. Even better, use a green star and get two points. And you never quite know what's going to make it onto the points list. It could be a hedgehog, a flamingo, an alligator, a unicorn, a catacorn. Who freaking knows? That's part of the fun of Calvin Ball. So how do these crazy rules get added to the list anyway? That is completely up to you. Every day you'll have the opportunity to leave your best suggestions for rules that should be added to the list. Those rules will be curated. They're not automatically added to the list and each day the new rules will be released. Some will make it to the permanent list and some will be on the temporary list it can help to think of the rules like a checklist. Did I use green? Check, that's one point. Did I use a star? Check, that's another point. One thing you may be wondering is where do we share all of the cool things we're making this month? We have a special gallery for you. In the Scrap Happy community, we have a special community area called Circle, and we're inviting all of our Calvin Ball friends to come and join us in our community. You'll only have access to a small portion of our community. We have a much larger area, but that's for our Scrap Happy members. If you want, you can come and join us. Within the Calvin Ball spaces, there are two of them. There is one for the gallery. This is where you can share all your wonderful creations that you make this month. And this is also the place where you will find the rules. The second space that we have there is the chatting section. In the chat, this is where you can start all of the topics, have questions, ask them there. Somebody will know the answer and be able to help you out in the best way possible. Also in the chat section, this is where you will find the leaderboard and points. This is where you can go and see who's at the top of the leaderboard right now and add your own points to the scoreboard too. But Alice, I'm worried about sharing stuff online. Well, sharing is completely optional. You don't have to share to participate in Calvin Ball. However, there are benefits to sharing, and one of those is points. So if you share your layouts to the Calvin Ball gallery, there will be special points for that. Check the rule sheet for the numbers. And remember, the internet is the internet. Once it's out there, you can't take it back. This gallery is a private gallery. We expect people not to share outside the gallery, but we have no control over that. So please protect your own privacy. What kinds of things count for points in Calvin Ball? Well, there are so many things that you can do. Of course, we love to see your scrapbook pages and those count in all forms. Whether you are a digi scrapbooker, pocket page scrapbooker, you use the Project Life app, you're doing traditional 12 by 12 pages, all of it counts. You can do smaller pages, those count too. And just check the points list for any confirmation on sizing and what actually counts. You can also do cards, you can do crafty projects and other creative projects, those things count too. So check the list. And when you're ready, you can tally up your points and add them to the leaderboard. You don't have to tally them every day. You can keep track of them on your own and add them once a week or whatever. It's up to you. 
However, at the end of the month, we do have a deadline to get your points added. So what do you collect all these points for? Well, we do have a leaderboard which gives you the honor and glory. It gives you bragging rights to reach the top of the leaderboard, but that's all. There are no prizes during Calvin Ball. It is completely for you to have fun and play with the cool things that are in your scrappy stash. We all have buried treasures and it's time to pull them out and use them and get them into our scrapbooks. And here's a tip, don't get overwhelmed by the number of points that are available on the board or the number of things that you're seeing people create. Scrapbook in your way, in your style, but let Calvin Ball be a way to help you dig into your scrappy stash and get you creating. Use it for inspiration, not for overwhelm. And because scrapbooking is always more fun with friends, we have two Calvin Ball crops happening this month, and I hope that you'll come and join us for those. These crops will be hosted on Zoom and you'll find the links in our community. Calvin Ball kicks off at 12.01 a.m. Pacific time. So if any projects you've made before that time cannot be counted for points, there's no pre-prep work that you can count for Calvin Ball. It's only what you're creating during the month of March and we're going to base it off of Pacific time. That's Los Angeles or Seattle time for anybody else in the world. And that's it. Watch your emails for Calvin Ball emails. They'll say Calvin Ball right at the beginning of the email so you don't miss them. And Calvin Ball is an exclusive list that is just for Calvin Ball. So you're not gonna see a bunch of extra mail from that. And if you are already a Scrap Happy member or you've done load courses or different courses with me, this is a separate thing. So make sure if you're unsubscribing from Calvin Ball, you use the link that says unsubscribe only from Calvin Ball because it really does matter. Okay, that's it. The game is underfoot. The only thing you need to know is that Calvin Ball is here for you to have fun. The rules will be always changing. It will be crazy, unpredictable, exciting, and a lot of fun. And I hope that you have a great time. If you have questions, don't forget to post them in the chat and I can't wait to see what you make this month. Let the games begin, woo!